Welcome back to the channel everyone. You might be in a situation where your Snapchat notifications are not working, so I'll show you exactly how to fix it. It's really easy, it doesn't really take too much time. But first thing, as usual, add me on Snapchat. There is the code, there is everything. I've been responding a little bit more to people, like usually I don't really respond that much, but if you comment like, oh I'm your biggest fan, whatever, like usually like I will support or whatever, like I'll comment back, that's, that's the least I can do. So add me there, it'll mean so much. But the process is really simple. If you have an iPhone, this is the way to do it. I'm sure on Android there's a similar method. None of my Android phones are charged so I wasn't able to do it. But what you want to do is you want to make sure you have Snapchat on your device. That's really really easy. If not, make sure you're on Snapchat. If you're updated to the latest version that's okay but it really doesn't matter. And so the process is really easy. Once you have Snapchat loaded up, what you want to do is you want to hit the settings bar right there and you want to scroll down until you see notifications which is right there so you want to tap that and you'll see the little bar up top where it says enable notifications now all you have to do right here is go and click this and it'll take you over here where I'll say Snapchat, whatever. And then you'll see you'll get, you get a little bar that says notifications. So what you want to do here is you want to go and click notifications. And you want to click allow notifications. And now this will give you a plethora of different options to choose from of how you want those specific notifications. Now if you're still stuck on this page, you might get a situation where it shows like a little box or something. And it says allow or don't allow. If that happens to you, you just want to click allow. That is the best thing to do in that situation. However, if you got the same thing that I did, then you're good. Now here you can customize which notifications you want. So you can get the lock screen ones, notification center ones, and the banners. So when someone snaps you, whether you're on your phone or not, you'll definitely get that notification. Now if you want to turn off the sounds and badges, that's one thing. So with the badges, as you can see, if I hop out, you can see I have 66 Snapchats that have a lot more than that. If I turn off badges, you'll see that that actually goes away. So you can keep that on if you want to. Not a big deal, but it is cool. If you want to keep that, you know, sounds on too, you have that capability and also these little two options down here show previews and notification grouping same thing goes if you have you know if you want to enable those you can do it now me personally I do not like having notifications on because a ton of people hit me up so I don't really feel like doing that and going through that again but again if you're in the situation all you have to do is click there click enable notifications and that'll allow you to get snapchat notifications that way so that's pretty much it if you guys run into any problems or anything let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that means so much but definitely hit that subscribe button every single subscriber that we get really does count so it means so much if you guys could hit that also check out the other links down in the description as well my twitter my instagram my second channel all those links are linked down below i'd really appreciate it if you guys could check it out more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then